shopping at Daiso so I can grab some more of those really cute Omikuji stickers to put on my New Year's cards. I need to get them sent like today. <laughs> I want them to get there the first week of January at the latest. So I really hope they still have some. I bet they're popular because they're really cute. So fingers crossed. Oh, they have different ones. These are really cute. Oh, these are Omikuji. Oh, these all are. They're all Omikuji. Okay, they don't have the ones that I was originally using, but these are adorable. I got some more decorations for the Christmas tree because they had some new ones I thought were really cute. And then I got the stickers. I'm so happy. They're so cute, guys. New Year's cards are all done. Oh, and I got to show you guys the stamps that I found. Onigiri stamps. That's just one of them. There's a norimaki one and all different kinds of like rice balls. <laughs> Aren't they so cute? got home the keyboard sun's still in the car but I gotta show you guys something so I found the shoes that I was looking for in Korea online but they only shipped to Canada so I got them shipped to my parents and then they shipped them to us and they made it in time for Christmas he just got inside so I gotta take them out of the box and rewrap them I'm just inside a restaurant with my friends now and I got a little present. It's my first Christmas present of the year. Can I open it now? Okay. <laughs> I know what one thing is. Okay, so when I was in Korea, they released a really weird Pepsi here in Japan. This one. And I wasn't here to buy it, so I asked my friend if she could pick it up for me. Christmas cake flavored Pepsi. Oh, you wrapped it really so nice. Oh, the paper shook. Oh, what's a cracker? <laughs> oh my god. I haven't seen these in like 10 years. Oh, I used to love these in Canada. Really? Yeah. Do you have the same ones? Um, I don't know what Rugs. Bro is, but <laughs> we have just like I think we have a few kinds of wasa crackers. What is that like rye? Mm. Yeah, I think so. It's like wheat, kind of. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> I love them. Oh, thank you. Oh, oh my God! It's so cute. Where did you find this? Oh my God! Strange world of cats. Oh my god, look at the face. It looks so realistic. That's exactly what Luda looks like when she like, lies down. <laughs> the chin roll. Oh, thank you. Oh my god. This one's even more like Luna. <laughs> These are so cute. At a store in Harajuku? Yeah, it's for Kibala actually. Really? Oh, thank you so much. Hi, it's pepperoncino. Hi, 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 and a bowl of spinach. I really crave spinach sometimes. I love it. Yeah, it doesn't. That's so strange. Yeah. We just noticed that on the package it doesn't say Christmas cake flavor, but when they were advertising it, like all the signs and everything said Christmas cake. It's weird. I wonder if it like didn't sell well at all because people were like, ew, cake flavor, so they changed it or something. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> what? Something about it tastes like coconut. Did you taste coconut? Like tastes like candy or something? It tastes like strawberries for sure, but then there's like this weird like fake coconut taste. <laughs> <laughs> Why did it put coconut in a Christmas cake? Yeah, the taste of Christmas. 
This is really outside. weird. Yeah, I would never buy this to like enjoy <laughs> it, but it's kind of fun. I was like, it's fun to try out the flavors they come up with every year. And Halloween, they usually do one too. Did they do Halloween one this year? Yeah, and Did they? it was just like cherry. Yeah, the Halloween one's usually yummy. Um, this is weird. <laughs> really weird but it's fun to try <laughs> you guys I just found the cutest Christmas card for my husband <laughs> you guys are gonna love it I'm not gonna show it to you until Christmas just in case he is watching this video I don't want him to see it but they have the cutest cat cards here but this isn't as good as the one I got you guys are gonna love it they have really cute schedules too it's so cute so for keyboard son's new job he needs to improve his business Japanese. So I'm gonna see if I can find him a book for Christmas. Don't know if they have any books here like that are geared towards foreigners. I did buy some Korean language books here once, but again, those were for Japanese people. Um, I found some Keigo books directed at Japanese people, so maybe these would be okay. Let's see how intense they are. Okay, I found a book that doesn't look too horribly boring. Like, it's Keigo, so it's not going to be interesting, but it's colorful at least. <laughs> Hope you can get some use out of it. Yeah. Number. Yeah, that's what they give you, right? Yeah. <laughs> I remember that when I first moved into my dorm. We're in the futon store now because my friend has a really, really thin <laughs> mattress at the moment, like this. <laughs> and it's really painful. So we're looking for something. Hmm. Even if you get like something like this, how much is this? Mm, I don't know. This is 12,000. Probably a lot of 12,800. Yeah. A fabric store. Aww. <laughs> a Dragon Ball Z. Oh, that's so cute. I'm Pan Man. Oh, they have pom pom pudding. Ooh, is that cinnamon roll? Oh, my melody. Oh, Too bad. Cute. That would be so cute. Oh, Barba Papa. Oh. Eight dollars. That's cute. <laughs> it's so cute. You can make your cat a bed or something. <laughs> You find a cute one. Oh, <laughs> see cute. me? Oh. Yeah, Pikachu and Sida. <laughs> Pikachu's face is falling off. And the Evo Popolio mm. all their legs. Mm. My Popolio. <laughs> Poor Popolio. <laughs> oh, they look so good in the example. <laughs> Expected versus <laughs> reality. <laughs> I'm inside the drugstore now because yesterday I packed up this really nice box of Japanese snacks for my friend in Australia and I went to the post office to send it and they like pulled out this big rule book and they showed me like no snacks to Australia. So apparently you're not allowed to send any food into Australia at all. So I'm in the drugstore now to look for some beauty products that I can send her instead. And I really hope I don't go there and they tell me no beauty products to Australia. I can totally see that happening. They seem to be super strict, but I'm gonna try. I figured I'd show you guys because these are some of the Japanese products that I love. So if you come to Japan, uh, get yourself a konyaku puff for cleaning your skin. I love these. This is the hard type and you just get it wet in water before you use it. This one's already moist. I like the ones that dry up though. I'm gonna get her one of these. Should I get her this? It's a pubic hair brush. In Japanese it says chiku chiku, which is like prickly, and then fluffy. <laughs> so apparently if you use this comb, it makes your pubic hair fluffy. I'm also looking for stocking stuffers for my husband. It's an ear cleaning stick. Made from like a coil? I guess it would like catch it and take it out really well, but I wonder how you clean it after. Ew. 
<laughs> it doesn't say anything about how to clean it. I'm definitely gonna send her some of these eye masks, but I already have a box at home. I'm gonna send her those. I showed these in a video like years ago, but they're an eye mask and once you put it on your eyes, it starts to heat up and steam comes out of it. And then they smell like different things and it lasts about 20, 20 ish minutes I would say. Oh, this one says 10 minutes. I feel like it's still semi warm for like 20, but it's nice to put it on right before you go to sleep. It's really relaxing and it like moisturizes your eyes. It's really cool. That's lavender, yuzu. These ones are nice. Chamomile ginger. Whoa, a menthol one. That's kind of cool. Maybe I'll get some of those for his stocking. Menthol eye mask. You can get some stocking stuffers for the cats too. Salmon, Atlantic salmon favorite. I feel like they'd like that. Wow, that's really big. Lots of them. Anything else? Oh, here we go. Something for Mar to chew on. He loves chewing stuff. Oh, that's for dogs. <laughs> They never make these things for cats, but Mara loves chewing. Oh, I wish they would. Like, I guess it's okay if he uses it, but some there's some things that are safe for dogs and not cats, so I wouldn't trust it. So. <laughs> oh my god, apparently it like makes the sides of your smile raise up and it's cuter. And then this one exercises your cheeks so they get bigger. We're outside looking for Pokemon now and we found some Christmas lights. You don't see that much in Japan. People don't decorate the outside of their houses very often, but every once in a while you'll come across a house that does. That's cool. Looks so nice, aw. Skyline. I actually don't see many of these around. They're rarer than you would think maybe because I live in the countryside all right time to pack up the box for Australia so there's those eye masks I was talking about I got her chamomile ones and then these are some really cute bath salts I guess but they kind of make your bath like creamy some of them have bubbles in them this one's supposed to make you sweat it has like ginger and stuff in it Strawberry and chocolate banana. Never tried them, but they look like they are really nice. And then I got her some Oshiriko socks, my favorite Japanese dessert. She really likes food. She has a really cute food Instagram, so I couldn't send her food, so here's the next best thing. And I was looking for these patches that you put on your legs and they like relax your muscles as you sleep. They're really nice. And Super relaxing, but I couldn't find them at the drugstore, so I'm gonna have to go back and get those, but gotta start. Almost done. You wanna be sent to Australia? I'm gonna say goodnight here. This is the end of Vlogmas Day 20. I'll see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 21. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Five more days of Vlogmas left. It's good in a way and bad in a way. I'm gonna miss you guys. But it'll be nice to have a little break. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, but I really enjoyed it. I'd like to thank you all so much for watching my vlogmas this year. It's been neat to comment back and forth to you every day and like get to talk to you guys every day. It's been really fun, so thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Tomorrow we're going to Tokyo, uh, Kibor-san and I. Um, I'll save the rest for a surprise. Good night, guys.